Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Co-op Super Mario Galaxy. I'm K6Scope, and I'm here with, as always... Argon Matrix and Mario. And this is the, like, fifth time we're trying to record this <laughs> godforsaken episode. <laughs> so if there's yeah. any discrepancies in counts, just forgive us. I think we're okay. Ooh, I, did I say okay? Oh, well. <laughs> okay, we're, uh, o we're okay. Daredevil comment. I've commented so many times in failed recordings, but I still can't get over the brilliance of that comment. Even though you can't really see it now. Oh, well. Wait, what was it? The brilliant shining light of the Daredevil comet. Oh, yeah. How, yeah. how just pure and full of awesome it is. I just want to hug it. True. Daredevil comet in orbit. Danger, Will Robinson. Hmm. So, Top Maniac's Daredevil run. Shouldn't be too bad. Love you can see him buzzing up there. That's cool. Top Maniac is just a crazy fool. I've come to that. <laughs> he is. He's so... I don't know. I'd love to have a Top Maniac as a pet. He's just so gay. <laughs> I don't know about that, but... Yeah, I guess. I would probably... Kill him. By the way, is it just near this... Is this, like, metal texture really realistic? I don't know. Probably. I'd it'd probably look more realistic at, uh... In person. Probably. Like, if I was watching a game... In reality. You know, there was a point in my youth when I was playing Super Mario RPG, and I was like, this is it, this is the best graphics are ever going to get. I had accepted that, and then they came out with, like, the N64, and was like, what the fuck? Blew your mind. Seriously. Yeah. Alright, so, same show as before, and he's done. He has killed me before in stupid ways, but not today. Too true. Mm. Oh god, I just can't wait till we get past this episode successfully. Dude, come on, even though we've recorded this one, you still need to sound enthusiastic. I mean, Oh it's, my it's... god, I'm so excited for this fucking episode! <laughs> <laughs> no, well that was obviously fake. Oh, wow. No, that was totally real in every sense of the word. Oh, I guess. I just want to uh, have sex with the Lumas, that's so wrong. Oh, no, not really. Yeah. Not particularly. Alright, back to stage. Does job. that mean you're thinking about it might be inappropriate? <laughs> I don't know. It all depends on the level. Oh wow, is this the level with the Olimar ship? I'm so excited to see that. I've never seen it before, ever, in my life. Dude, we saw it like it was in one of the other missions that's already on video, so. Oh yeah. Well. Dude, you sound so dead. Dude, oh. I'm alive and kicking. Terran talks this tangled web. Oh, this galaxy has so many missions, it's crazy. Yes. Mm. So many missions. It does. It's like, it's weird because these, um, I think Ow. Galaxy 2, there's like seven worlds per, or seven galaxies per world. And in this game, there's like Stop. five, so they have like six stars each. Yeah. But I guess in it Galaxy 2, once the green stars appear, each level does have about six stars each, too. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, they either have four or six when the green stars appear. It's weird how I always try to keep the green stars equal to the amount of regular stars. Mm -hmm. This cylinder is awesome. It's transparent, but it's not at the same time. I don't know. It's something about it. But it's beautiful. Oh, is this oh my god! So much failing in the last recording. That was no, weird. no. That was sling. That was sling pod galaxy. Oh, oh don't remind me. <laughs> I don't know why I suck. So that's an easy galaxy. But... Dude, I have so much fail coming up in my SMG2 LP, I'm so... Ooh, right. I can't it's like, it's to the Wait. point... Oh, I'm rubbing my hands together, but there's a Wiimote and a nunchuck there, so it's not it's not working. It's like to the oh, point where I'm afraid to upload it, but it but it's hilarious at the same time. Like, it's... it's forget, You'll understand when you see this. <laughs> All fails, hilarious. What are you talking about? Yeah, sometimes. Unless, like, the person's getting genuinely pissed, and you're like, ow, I feel bad. But I was just yeah. laughing, because it was ridiculous. Um, uh... Oculus. Oh, I love this little platform here. I remember you said it looks like the Shadow Temple entrance. Yeah, it does. Once upon a time. It's pretty cool. Alright, so be honest. How many All those spires just avoided me. What the how heck? many times do you think you've played this level in your life? Like, this level is in this mission, or this level this, is in, in this, mission. this galaxy? This mission. Seven? Seven. Well, we've done it four times in just 
this LP. <laughs> Dude, we've done a th three. Three. This is the third time. Yeah, maybe. So you think you've only done it like three, four other times total? All right, you you just get out of here, dude. Whatever. You did it on the stream once. No, I did it on the you stream did it twice. Twice, twice did. and then you did it at least once the first time you played the game. So that's that's almost seven right there. That's six. Yeah, you that's about right. You've only done it one other time. Yep. Probably. Get yourself a poopy right up all that. God, these spiders are so freaky. You broke the spider. You broke. The spider. I mean, just look at their legs. Well, you can't really see them from here, but. Yeah, he's got this little, these little spindly legs, it's so scary. The ship has always looked like such a nice texture though, I mean look at it. It is, it's great. It's like mm, a busted and space fucked. It reminds me of the box art for Dead Space that I still have to open. Oh. Dead Space is such a great game. You remember what mm. I told you though, right? How you have to play it, there are requirements. Yep. Oh man, look at this thing, what the hell? What? W-F-T. <laughs> Well, let's just launch into it, because that seems like a valid idea. Ew. Let's just jump right in. That's weird, I wouldn't have thought to do that in the real game. Like, if I was playing this, I wouldn't have thought to just shoot into that random thing. Oh. Mario, there's a coin by your head! <laughs> what is that thing? It's a coin! <laughs> That's awesome, that's like a perfect visual. Okay. Very sexually pleasing. Alright, and let's do it again! God, you better like not take. You better like speed run this boss right now. Like not even take you know a hit. I was. I've been thinking like so many times in the failed recordings that this guy reminded me of something. And I could never put my finger on it, but I totally know it now. It's the the little alien dudes in a uh, Toy Story because of his three eyes. Oh yeah, that's true. Whoa! Claw. Uh, claw. <laughs> exactly what I was thinking. Claw controls all. All right, so we got to hit the glaring weak point on his butt. For some point, for some small reason, that was like my favorite part of the Toy Story movies is like the claw section. I don't know why. That I was like in, in the uh, game. That was the best part too. Like the Toy Story game. Yeah. I don't think I ever beat the Toy Story game that I own. The only one I own. It's fucking hard. It is hard. Dude, don't miss! Holy shit, he's gonna get up. You're a certified pro at this stuff, I am. There we go. But he's coming back for round two. Round two. Oh no! Okay. Now this section reminds me of Battletoads for some reason. He looks like there's a Battletoad. So there's, there's so many streams of like... Probably because he's got pimples or zits on him. <laughs> oh yeah. He's probably got a rash somewhere too. Alright, oh, get over there. Rash. Alright, we got him. Man, could they make that weak point in his butt any bigger? Seriously. No, dude. You're gonna miss this. They just turn into anuses when you hit them, too. It's so rude. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. That's the only way of looking at it. And you die with your rubbery feet. The suction cup feet. Except you die. Oh my god. Oh! Man, that star came up fast. Oh yeah, and we talked about how beautiful this was. How, like, bright the uh, spider web is. It's just so beautiful, and the lens flare adds to it is pretty great so silky white, but we don't have time to admire it because we're recording. Oh. No, we're not. Wait, we're recording I would, this? I would, I would sleep here. Uh, yeah, we're, we're recording, man. Damn. About 8 minutes and 49 seconds. <laughs> That's hardcore. It is. Black Luma. Huh. <laughs> you sound, you suddenly sound more muffled in this type call. I don't know if that'll affect the recording, but, ooh, a hungry Luma has appeared. It but fucking better not. <laughs> I'm sure we can deal with it. Yeah, I don't care how crappy this one turns out, it's going up. There's no if ands, or buts about that. What if you sound like Sir Ron Lionheart? I don't care. I will... Just, you're just gonna have to say this episode was with Sir Ron Lionheart, and I can make <laughs> All it. Right. Featuring special guest, Hungry Luma. I'm famished, I need 400 Starbucks to curb the hunger pangs. Pang. Yep. Pang, pang. God. That's one little thing that I like about uh, Galaxy 1 that is better than Galaxy 2, another little thing, is when you feed the Hungry Lumas in this game, the stream of Starbits is way more laminar than in uh, Galaxy 2. Yeah, Galaxy 2 does seem a little half-assed. Yeah, for those who actually know what laminar means, I apologize. Mm. How many do you think it would be? Six, like our life count. Our life count sucks, dude. <laughs> a very sticky situation. Oh, 
Oh, cause spider webs. Cause, cause it's sticky. Get it? Yeah. And um, situation is yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways. So Obviously. This galaxy is pretty great for grinding star bits, and it's also great for dying, apparently. Get yourself a poopy. Yeah, you, say you, it. you you die, you, you die like a hundred times here. And I'm always so scared that when I stretch too far back, I'm just gonna wind up in one of the cannon paths. What? Dude, already? <laughs> and so it begins. Dude. Uh, second verse, same as the first. It's just, I don't know. It's not even an easy one up in this area, so I, I might get a game over if I don't, if I screw up too much. Nah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. I don't even know why I tried to go to that one. I'll just go for this one. Yeah. There we go. And wait for the break. Here we go. The break. <laughs> and we got this little minefield here. And then we started talking about Finding Nemo for some reason. I remember that. Oh, yeah. What? Oh, you said it reminded you of Finding Nemo, I think. Yeah, that one, like, mine that, like, with the underwater mines that are so scary in that movie. What? Oh, my God. Oh yeah, and then we talked about how the fish <laughs> tank was great. That was cool. The yep. fish tank was great. The fish tank was awesome. I was always so scared for a little Nemo going through like the filter. <laughs> Fucking Nemo. <laughs> Nemo's awesome. I don't know about that guy sometimes. He's a crazy... He's a crazy clownfish, what can I say? Oh no. Yeah, I'm not gonna go for that wife, that's just... that. None of that wife... Dude, you need to talk. Like a person. Yeah, that's Go for that wife. Yeah. It's probably preferable. Talking like a person generally works. Generally. Watch for the fire bars. You got this, man. You got this. Yeah. You don't got this. What the fuck was that? That was a death. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was perfect. It oh. was very serendipitous. The two true. Serendipitous. Dude. Oh, alright. Shut up, fucking tard. Because <laughs> I'm going for that again. Wait, what? Oh, you. I screwed? Can I, can I like, there we go. No, you get spot. What? <laughs> Dude, at least I you're not dying. The... That's true. That was stupid. These are probably the most lethal fire dicks in the game, I'd say. Yeah, probably. I mean, look how long and, like, luxurious they are. It's not the first time I've heard that. <laughs> well, these ones aren't so bad. These ones are just... Uh, kind of like plantains, they're little. Those are their average. Yep. Well, you should have it this time. Oh, go! Dude, there's an opening. <laughs> an opening? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it doesn't work, that one. You just sound like Yoda when you do that, with, like, long syllable words. Yeah, I think I was trying to sound like Yoda subconsciously, I don't know why. Oh, well. Ah, uh, man, that, over that area over there in the observatory is still all dark. That's annoying. Oh, well. Yeah. Oh, we've got 10 10 star bits. Cool. 10 10. Mm, but no, it's 2010. But no, it's actually 2012. I'm just stupid. Oh. <laughs> it's 2010. What the hell? I'm living in the past. Living on the toilet. Ba -da -ba -da. So, are there any stars left besides uh, the big bad brute himself? Um, no. I think so. Oh, we are clear, and we've got a lot. We've we're not that far into the episode yet. 14 minutes. Yeah, no, we're doing good. But so, uh, let's go. Zer in his fiery red eye. Yeah, I think you died more last time. I think I did. I guess I'm just getting good. Well, repetition is the key. Oh, ooh, the fiery stronghold. Can't wait. Can't wait. Dude, I feel like I've been saying everything. You need to say something. Go off on a topic right now. Go. Anything. Um. Anything? Now, dude, hurry. Come on. Well, you can't pressure me like this, man. I don't know. Burning minutes here. Come on. Fuck minutes. We're burning daylight, except it's nighttime. I love Halo. I've never played Halo. Oh my god, seriously? How about this? You're gonna play Halo. 
I'm also going to watch Star Wars on the same day. No, I you're going to play Halo a lot sooner than you think. I, I, do you ever, have you ever played like any first person shooters? I played, uh... Yeah, I know I you played, played Call of Duty on the Wii, but that doesn't count. <laughs> doesn't count. It's so bad. Oh it does. God. It's like, it's like they released that out of pity. I don't even... <laughs> Gravity puzzles. Arr. Do we need to talk about the game here? I don't know. No, you're gonna play. It is a boss level, so maybe we should, but... It's pretty self-explanatory, just gravity fuck. Same same shit, different day, you know? What are you gonna talk about? Does Halo have gravity fuck? I think Oh, not. Halo Maybe. has <laughs> multiple gravity fucks. They have gravity lifts, you can shoot yourself into sex. Whatever that camera angle changes like with these platforms, it always causes like vertigo for me, I don't know. It's like I get all disoriented and then I run headlong to a fire stick or something stupid. Fire dicks. Did I see what I, th what I thought I just saw up there? There's a star right there. Like, a, like an honest to goodness star, not a power star. Oh yeah, like a real, for real star. What the hell? Oh my god. How was I supposed to avoid that? There was nothing you could do, bro. Guess not. There was nothing you could do to save your ship. reminds me of Bowser in the sky that, with that little platform down there. Bowser in the sky with diamonds. Man, so many fire bars. Get yourself a fireball, Look get it up on sky. Uh, fire. Fireballs? Oh no. Look who it is. <laughs> Shooting meteors instead of just fireballs. That's just such a good... That's just a good mechanic. Mm -hmm. um, it is. I don't know how he lost that in Galaxy 2. That would've been awesome. Oh. <laughs> he looks so jolly when he's shooting them up there. Just look at him. He's so happy. Yeah. You finally made it. Just in time for me to stomp you into space balls. Is that? Oh, that's just bits. Never mind. <laughs> you thought it said balls? I thought balls. it said space that's balls. That would have been awesome. That's, I was like, nice awesome. reference. Oh, man. So Bowser in this game, he's pretty epic in this game. I like him. Oh god, that was so close. Ah, so you gotta get him to stomp those blue plasma glassy things. And then the rest is history. Just spin him in the tail. The rest as they say. Yep. Man, what is that in the background? It's like a sea of cosmic clone stuff? I don't know. Mm. I just think it's... I don't know. I kind of thought you fell asleep for a minute there, not gonna lie. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> you just went dead quiet for <laughs> like, a full like 10 seconds straight. I'll be honest, I was trying to fart. <laughs> I was oh, trying to, and I was trying to make it audible in the call, but I don't know. I didn't hear shit, man. All right, so we what do you... ain't found shit. All right, so I'm, I know your answer on this one, but what what do you prefer, Galaxy One Bowser fights or Galaxy Two Bowser fights? Galaxy One for sure. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, here's a better question, a follow-up question: favorite Bowser fight in any game ever? Um, except for Brawl. Brawl doesn't count. Those are epic. Brawl doesn't count. Okay. Well, the Giga Bowser fight in there is epic. Well, I wasn't gonna say that anyways. I was gonna say uh, the final battle of Mario 64. Really? And yeah, Bowser. Yeah, Rainbow Bowser. Oh, he look, he's dead already. I think Chugga Conroy tweeted that um his Super Mario 3D Land the finale Bowser fight was the best Bowser fight ever. Right. What? How? Foolish Mario, your plan is too far. My plan is too far along now, but yours is pretty far along too, probably. You really think you could stop me? <laughs> <laughs> Bowser. Uh, I always feel so bad when I like voice act stuff. I don't know why. I guess I watch too much Retro Prey. Some. Yeah, they're dude. always like. If they Retro Prey this episode, we'd be fucked. <laughs> <laughs> they totally. Suck. That would be awesome. I guess there's nothing wrong with leaving yourself open to it, though. Er, let's just take a tour for a minute. Admire the scenery. I did that once, and the first well, time the I played a uh, Mario. Camera angles. Uh, I beat um, Bowser in the Dark World. 
while the key was sitting there, I went and took a tour, and I long jumped into a bomb, and it actually blew me up and killed me. I didn't think it would. <laughs> <laughs> nice. There's not much to see here, though, so... Grandiose! I mean, beep! <laughs> yeah, don't don't be swearing now. Don't be, don't be, beep! Star! Ooh. That's a little Luigi galaxy. A thousand right in the sky with titties. Oh, man, what colors are Beacon gonna turn out? I'm so excited, can't wait to see! It's gonna turn green, we already seen it three times, bro. No, it's gonna be Heliotrope! Oh, it's green. It's green. Boom! Oh yeah, we talked about that too. That was a good topic. How the price is right sound when you lose is just so weak. It's like <laughs> it is. Ooh, you don't. Wait, did we talk we about that? Was that somebody else? Probably someone else. I don't know. Uh, but about? we live. I don't know. Galaxy complete. There's nothing else in that Bowser level ever again. Never again. Ooh, four new galaxies. Can't wait. I'm so excited. I would have never foresaw that. I'm so excited. I was Cosmic Bowser. I actually am excited you... now. We might actually get to move on. You rescued another grand star. Powers returned to another dome in the back of the observatory. She said at the back. <laughs> but I still don't think we have the, pow the star power we need to fly the observatory through the universe. Darn. Wah, wah, wah. The villain who kidnapped your special one took her far from here, to the center of the universe. Once our star power is restored, the observatory will be able to go there. Then you can reunite with your special one. Can't wait to reunite with Luigi. Hey. <laughs> Fucking uh. Luigi, man. He'll be like, bro, you made it! And then we'll have spaghetti and it'll be good times. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs. So, I think we're gonna have to call it, because that's about 22 minutes. Yeah, unless, that's unless, it. You, unless you want to do like another five stars, and I'll speed run it. Uh, I don't think so, bro. No. Oh, all right, fine. You're no fun. I know. I'm just a boring ass. Boring <laughs> ass. I was trying to be all skilled and go for that one up, and just, what the hell? And then you fail. I did fail. Let's try it again. What? <sighs> Dude, it's a simple wall jump. Oh well. It's not. All right. So, um, thank you, everyone. There it is for joining us in our little adventure here. Sorry if we sound kind of just out of it. You, you should know why by now. Yeah, you should. <laughs> Next time we'll be better, I promise. Maybe. Probably. For, for now, just enjoy the cabinet tree here that you see in the kitchen. It's awesome. It's pretty this great. Is the, this is the kitchen. See that? A kitchen? So thanks everyone for watching. This has been Argon Matrix and K6 Scope. See you next time where we actually make progress. Yes. Yay! Yes. Yay! Yeah, progress. Spring break. Oh no. Nope. Dark testing. And I think we'll just end off the episode on that. You saying nope? Dark testing. Fade to black right there. There you go. It's perfect.